French.
Is anybody home? Carmen Elvis, and you are all home. I leave the building, gotta come to the phone. Carmen Elvis, and you are all home. Now tell them I was calling. Switching weather. Never leave my number. Heartbreak Hotel. Oh, let me take up. Baby, don't be cool. Return to Cinder. Dream your life for Steve Barron, who did um, the Money for Nothing clip, it has done a thing for Calling Elvis. And he got the idea to animate, in, in the same as he animated Money for Nothing, he had the idea of using the Thunderbirds people and using puppets and, uh, uh, and mixing it in with a real situation. In other words, yours truly tries to call home. I like the Thunderbirds because it was a real it was like a, a Brit attempt at what we thought the future was going to be like. A few years ago, I wanted to do a um, Thunderbirds-related video, a video where um, we built the band as puppets and things. And uh, it's a very expensive operation uh, because you're dealing with everything in miniature. And so all these sets of, in that miniature world have to be built. And uh, um, the operation of the puppets and things very involved, time-consuming. He showed me the storyboard, and um, I decided that it not only the idea looked great, but I'm a great fan of his. And so I was delighted, really, to be invited to join in. The whole um, problem with making this video, from my point of view, is that, first of all, we had to recreate the whole technique. And then, of course, we had to build the puppets the replicas of the band, and obviously we showed them at every stage to make sure they were happy, and Steve also checked them out. And uh, at the end of the day, I was really quite pleased. I think the likenesses are quite good. They are caricatures, of course, but they're sort of kind caricatures. There's really one interface with the puppets that goes on here early on, which is behind over Mark's sh puppet Mark's shoulder to the girl on the TV set, which is this abstract way of looking from inside the TV set. There's a certain lens we're using a lot of here because, you know, as part of the concept, we wanted it all to be within um, places that you wouldn't normally be, like you're in the light socket and, and you're up to the spy hole on, on the door and um, you're through the toaster and that sort of thing. And we're using this lens called a, lens called a borescope, which is a, a very tricky, time-consuming lens to fiddle around with as well but it gets great results. We, d we ran the, the, the pictures of how they looked and things, and uh, yeah, it always brought a laugh. I mean, I think, you know, you've, obviously they're caricatures,
but they they're very good caricatures and very strong and um, it looks um it's a you know it's a, obviously an ab, a, a more abstract idea but that's that's better i mean we've all seen bands getting up on stage a million times and playing away this is a variation on that this you know in scale um looks like a, a real rock and roll stage and thing especially first single off the album i think you've got to come out with something that is fresh new adventurous brave different and uh and compl totally complementary to the track All right. 